What you need, Elizabeth? Oh, Olaf! Hello! You get remade every day? Well, that's pretty cool. Who are you, Super Olaf? <gasps> Hello, Matthew! Life is never born with that little one. <laughs> so, welcome to my plans for next year. This is the plans for my first creator, that one that you saw. I am doing separate videos for our together work and each of my kids first, third, and eighth graders, or seventh graders. So, if you are interested in the other grades, be sure to look below for the links for that, as well as for the blog post that's going, that'll link the curriculum that I'm mentioning. So, let's get started with, with Matthew. He, um, I, through first grade, I really am a strong proponent of play is learning. So he's not done a lot this year, some, um, I'm quite satisfied with what he's done. Um, next year we'll increase the amount, but still um, I don't really start expecting a lot more um, seated work until until second grade. So Matthews, and pardon me if I look down, my notes are all down here. Uh, math. I am planning to, we've used Klee Math this year mostly. Um, I have a review of that. If you're interested, I will pop up a card. Um, I have been pleased with it well enough, but I already own Math Mammoth, and I think Math Mammoth will be a good fit for him, so I'm just going to switch him to that, and so he'll be doing Math Mammoth 2 next year. Um, we will also do first language lessons. One, he has sat in for books one and two this year and last year, um, but not always every lesson and you know, been hit or miss. He really likes sitting in to memorize the poems and look into the artwork and stories. But next year he'll start doing that as a his own lesson. Um, we will also be doing, well, I don't I am working with him right now on Bear Necessities for learning to read. We'll see where he is later in the summer. We will either choose the next book in this or I will just go on to explore the code. I'm not sure yet. We'll see. Um, and if so, we'll just start with book one and progress from there. Writing. We don't do a lot of writing at this age. We, I really focus on a lot of reading to them and that kind of thing to build up their skills before we start because writing before they can do a whole lot of spelling or anything to me is just way more work. We do do some um, reverse dictation where he tells me the story and I write it for him but that's about all we do for that. Um, history he'll sit in of course with us on our story of the world and then I am going to start him with some geography next year but I don't know what we've used um, graphs maps and charts book a with Ben and I liked it well enough so I don't know if we if I'm going to do that or if I'm going to pull him into my third graders work for geography which I will of course link in another one um, it's leagues and legends that I'm doing so haven't quite decided on that one yet and I may end up not doing anything formal for geography with him um, I don't know if I do anything formal it will probably will not be on a consistent basis um, just because I don't think it's really necessary science of course he'll be doing our work with us um, which next year will be his first year where I'm going to, you know, require him to sit in on history and science. He's never really had that requirement before, though he does a lot. So that shall be interesting for him. And then Bible. So I guess that's uh, all for him 
feels like oh i also want to mention that um he's really been interested in learning to spell so i think i think i'm going to look at spelling workout a for him we will either do that or all about spelling one um i'm not sure which one yet like i said <laughs> my plans are mostly firm but still a couple things that i need to decide on so that's that for my first grader if you have any questions about these um be sure to ask to leave a comment below um if you have a first grader, I'd love to hear what you're doing next year. I think it's always fun to um, you know, share ideas. So, um, and then again, if you are interested in a third grade, seventh grade, or um, history science, check out those video links below. And thanks for watching. Bye.